everybody, it's Lisa Joy Young here, and this is my first uh, video for the Fast Face Painting series. And I'm going to do a butterfly on my daughter, Faith. Um, we've been playing around today, so she's has a little bit of makeup on her right now, but that's okay. So what I'm going to do is on this side of her face, I'm just going to do a really quick freeze mm -hmm. so you can see how fast you can do it. And on the other side of her face, I'm going to do it step by step for you guys. All right, so let's get started. I'm sorry, I don't know if you guys can hear that, but my son is not happy about nap time. So that's him, if you're wondering, not wanting to nap. Go in the night, Jack Jack. Here, turn on, babe. Okay, so there you go. So you can multiply that by two, and that's how long this would have taken me. So let me go ahead and do it step by step for you guys really quick. Now, one huge time-saving trick is to have a rainbow cake. It makes it look a lot more impressive. So we're just going to drag the sponge on that rainbow cake, making sure not to mix the colors up. Going one direction, concentrating the color on the edge of the sponge right here. And then you're going to take that edge, start with the lightest color just because it's more flattering at the corner of the eye, going at an angle, and pouncing the edge down the eye, pivoting it from this bottom corner around the eye, just like that. And that quickly, you have your base for the butterfly. I'm gonna do the same thing. This one's harder, so I always keep um, a wipe handy just because it tends to get all over the nose. So keep your wipe handy and then wipe it in your desired shape. Then uh, whatever size brush you feel comfortable working with, for this part, I like a skinny one. It just, when you're going fast, it's easier to work with a skinnier one. Turn around. And you're gonna start with a little bit of pressure, lots of pressure. Keep it a continuous motion in a swirl. And you're gonna do the same thing right there. And then now that we have a little less paint on our brush, it'll be easier to make a skinny line. So we're gonna go back up here and finish that line. Do the same thing down here, skinny, pressure, swirl, swirl. Then get a nice fat brush with some white on it, like this. Do some dots, quick little dots of different sizes and a couple teardrops. All right, and that's it. Sorry about the crying, you guys. Hopefully you were able to hear over it. But um, I hope that was helpful to you, and I'll be coming out with three more.